Hi everyone, my name is Nick Hyatt. Welcome to my overview for my CG Master Academy course that teaches production illustration and environment painting techniques. In this course I'm going to show you my process starting off from a thumbnail and going all the way to a final image. Okay, so here is our final image that we that I create here and this is a combination of using 2D and 3D elements and uh, basically this is our final goal so I'm going to walk through each week and what this course is going to cover. So in week one we're going to do thumbnails right and uh, we're going to take our favorite thumbnail and we're going to create a color key from it and here is our final uh, color key here. So this is our final color key for week one this is what we use from our thumbnails this essentially gives us our time of day our materiality and our light direction and this is a good uh, this is how we end up on week one and on week two we move over to uh, our 3D scene and we set up our 3D camera we get our camera aligned we start uh, getting our 2D elements aligned to our 3D scene so we can pair back and forth from 3D, 3D to 2D so week two is essentially setting up your 3D scene and then doing some Photoshop painting for our environment work week three will be refining the environment painting a little bit and as well we're going to cover kit bashing some architecture in ZBrush where I'll show you my workflow for kit bashing architecture for the background uh, uh, structures and the retaining wall for our arena here and in week four a really fun week we cover kit bashing mechs and I show you my workflow in ZBrush for uh, kit bashing mechs and this is the mech right here that we kit bash so some really cool looking stuff I show you my workflow using IMM brushes in ZBrush and I show you how to create IMM brushes in ZBrush and how you can kit bash your own mech out of pieces. And then in week five, which is a really fun week, I show you my workflow for creating these really cool characters in Daz 3D. And I cover my process of creating the characters in Daz as well as exporting the characters into Maya so you can bring them into your 3D scene and establish your camera and lighting and all that good fun stuff. And in week six, we're going to be uh, finalizing all of our 3D models, and we're going to be creating this little riser here. Uh, and I show you my workflow on creating props uh, using uh, custom modeling and kit bashing. And then we cover texturing these props as well. And then in week seven, we're going to be doing our final paint work in week seven and week eight. So week seven and week eight are mostly final painting, where I cover my process of painting this mech. We paint this background arena here and we show you know how to add our, our crowd and our paintwork to all this arena and uh, that covers week seven and then week eight we do our final polish we are done in 3D by that week and we pretty much just cover how to put final touches on the painting how to get your painting ready adding grain adding depth of field focal blur and in between week seven and week eight we also cover render passes and render layers in uh, 3D so we can help make our 2D paintwork easier Cool, so that's a brief overview of my course. We take it all the way from thumbnail into 3D and into our final image right here. This is going to be a fun course. I hope you enjoy and learn something from it. And uh, yeah, it's going to be a fun one. Dig in.